Mitigation banking is restoring degraded ecosystems to provide offsets for impacts from development, both through transportation, commercial, residential, industrial type developments. The types of ecosystems we're looking to restore are streams and wetlands that are regulated under the Clean Water Act. We find degraded channels that have either been channelized or are degrading naturally due to a disconnected floodplain, agricultural practices, other types of farming, and we restore those. A lot of stream restoration is because we're trying to reduce pollutants in the channel. The number one pollutant in the southeast is sedimentation. As streams erode and that sediment gets in the channel, it decreases oxygen in the channel, which is not good for fish and certain types of macroinvertebrates. Over the years, as we go back during monitoring periods to see the vegetation growing up and see fish in the stream, like it's, it's very rewarding. Headwaters is a fully owned subsidiary of GMC. It is our construction arm for these mitigation banks. We are one of very few companies in the nation that are fully integrated in that we can find the sites, we can get the sites permitted, we can get the sites designed, and then we can hand those design plans to our construction team. And we got a team of really experienced operators with over 30 plus years of experience. So those guys show up on site with everything they need and they build what, what we draw. We can go in and do maintenance on those channels. If for some reason we have a drought and our vegetation's not doing well, we can go in and supplemental plant those areas. GMC's environmental department has well over 200 years of combined experience performing wetland and stream mitigation and the establishment of mitigation banks throughout the Southeast. Collectively, our team has designed hundreds of thousands of linear feet of stream channel. Our construction team has built tens of thousands of linear feet of stream, and we've planted hundreds of thousands of trees in both wetland and stream buffer areas. Because GMC Environmental is engaged with our engineering and architecture teams, we feel like we're on the forefront of knowing where permits are going to be needed and therefore can target areas throughout our collective footprint to place mitigation banks. We've successfully done that in Alabama and we are currently putting two in Tennessee in both the Memphis and the Nashville District and are looking to do the same in both Georgia and South Carolina. We've got biologists, ecologists, environmental scientists. Our engineers range from biosystems to civil to environmental engineering. Over the years, GMC Environmental has built a team capable of handling every aspect of the mitigation banking process, including initial site evaluation, coordination with the regulatory agencies, wetland and stream design, construction and construction oversight, agency site visits, credit release activities, and long-term bank monitoring and credit sales. GMC's relationships throughout the Southeast include clients such as universities and schools, transportation departments, airports, developers, all of which may need wetland and stream credits due to their developing projects. GMC's relationships with these people and understanding what projects are coming in the future allows our environmental team to site mitigation banks in areas we believe will have strong markets and strong credit sales. At GMC, our mantra is building communities. We feel like this type of ecosystem restoration is building ecological communities in the terms of you know, food webs and bringing in macroinvertebrates and fish. And so by providing that habitat and restoring these stream channels to what they should be, we are restoring those ecological communities.